The information you need in order to include a journal article in your bibliography or reference list is contained in what is known as a citation. It's important that you know how to read a citation in order to cite your sources properly. This will help you find an article when its full text is not available online. Each article, whether it is from an academic journal, a magazine, or a newspaper, has two titles. There is the title of the actual article and the title of the magazine, newspaper, or journal in which the article was published. While both titles are important to your reference list or list of works cited, it is the title of the journal that will help you locate the actual article if it is not full text in the database you are using. Most often, the journal articles you use in your research will have been found using one of the library's article databases such as Academic Search Complete. It's sometimes easier to read the citation if you display the detailed record for an article by clicking on its title. Let's look at the first title in this list. Here, the journal title is labeled as the source. In other databases, it may be referred to as the publication title. The title of the actual article is sometimes simply called the title or may not be labeled at all. In an article database, the journal title will usually be accompanied by a series of numbers and a date. These are all important parts of the citation and will assist you in citing the articles in your paper, as well as finding the full text of the article. The date is fairly easy to identify in this example. In Academic Search Complete, the volume and issue numbers are clearly labeled. This is not always the case. The next set of numbers represent the pages on which the articles appear in the original print journal. And finally, the total number of pages in the article. Now let's look at a typical citation for a journal article, the way you might see it in a bibliography or reference list. We'll start with the citation in APA format. The author's names will be listed first, followed by the date of publication. The title of the article will come next. Because the title of the journal is so important, it is usually made to stand out in some way. In APA format, the journal title is capitalized and in italics. Then come the volume and issue numbers and the page numbers. When the publisher has provided a DOI, or Digital Object Identifier, it is included at the end of the APA citation. If the article does not have a DOI, the home page URL of the journal completes the citation, even if the full text of the article was retrieved from a database such as Academic Search Complete. In MLA style, the date comes later in the citation. The journal title is in italics, and the volume and issue numbers are separated by a period. The page numbers follow, and the medium of publication, such as print or web, completes the citation. 